Hey guys, it's Janie. Welcome back to the Crafting and Bookworm. We're on day four of 21 Reasons to Praise Him. Welcome back everyone welcome new subscribers thanks to all of you I'm so glad you're here um, with me while we're doing this Bible study um, make sure you go visit Diane's channel it'll be linked down below she is the um, she's the one that started this Bible study she does Bible studies quite often so you can always go over there and check those out so I also decided um, we're on verse 4. I'm just going to use what Diane has printed out here. This is the English Standard Version. And my Bible stays with me at my desk. So rather than having to keep transporting it back and forth, I'm just going to use this. So verse 4 says, One generation shall commend your works to another and shall declare your mighty acts. Okay, so... Let me get our little study journal here. And here we go. This is going to be four and five, you guys. Because it's the center, so I just broke it up into the two. Okay, so our psalmist, David, here is, um, he's witnessing to God's people and he's encouraging them you know to praise and do that together and pass that along um, especially to get it to the next generation um, this is what we need to do as well we need to teach others about God's works and pass it along as one generation passes over, we can make sure or teach others to also pass it along. Um, we can teach our children, and then their children can teach children their children, and on and on. You can, you know, pass this along to your friends and your family, your neighbors, just so it's this never-ending cycle. As I said way back when doing the Peace of God Bible study, the Word of God is never going to go away. You know, it is always going to be there. It is a firm foundation. And it's up to us to help spread that along and to, you know, make sure we pass it down. It's important for us to spread the Word of God, His love, His grace, His faithfulness to other people. This world needs God. If we had God as number one, there would be more goodness in the world. And I, I feel like we can all um, agree with that. Um, we just, you know, the world needs God. I really feel that in my heart. And I know there's going to be naysayers, you know, and people out there saying that that's not true. But it's really, really important for us to spread the word of God. Just like it said, one generation shall commend your works to another. We, we, need to, we need to spread it, you guys. We need to talk about God and, you know, his love and faithfulness. Okay, so I need to... Here we go. I need my scissors. What have I done? Oh, Wavi over here. And we need to take our scripture off of here. I'm going to trim this down a bit.
Okay. Now, where are we going to put this? Right there. Because like I said, this is going to be five. Okay. Here is my gluing cardstock. And I made sure I had number four and not the wrong one. It is hard to get a hold of it to pick it back up. Okay. That did not, after all that, I didn't get this edge glued. Impossible. Okay. And there we go, you guys. There is verse 4 for our 21 Reasons to Praise Him. I hope you guys are enjoying um, this Bible study. I know I am enjoying it. And it's just really inspiring to to work on these, these um, Bible studies. Yep, so I hope you guys are enjoying it. Let us know down in the comments below if you are following along and doing the Bible study as well. It's only day four. You guys can still go to Diane's Etsy shop and pick up the kit. So you can make your own journal. She also has a process of making the one that she made. I did not have the time to do that this time. So um, yeah, go over there and watch hers. Get the kit and everything and you can make your own little study journal for this bible study but i think that's all i have for you guys today so thanks for staying tuned and i'll see you in the next video bye